Hi, this is Nathan from Club Card TV. Today I'm going to show you how to create an account and place an order on clubcardprinting.com. Uh, we'll start at the home page here. Uh, first thing you want to do is go to the top right corner of the screen and click the login button. From this page you're able to either log into your account if you're a returning customer or create a new account here on the right. Uh, so we'll do that by filling in the uh, information in the boxes. For the email address, you'll want to make sure it's an email that you check regularly because all of your order status updates will go to that address. So once all that information is filled in, click create a new account at the bottom. And you'll see you're now logged into the website. Click return to home page. For the purpose of this video, we're going to be ordering business cards and postcards. Uh, those kind of products will be able to be located underneath the products drop down menu here. Uh, if you don't see what you're looking for underneath that products list, you can head to the custom quote button in the middle of the uh, page. Once you click that, you'll be able to fill out a form uh, requesting a custom quote for any type of printing that you're looking for. So we'll head to business cards. 16 point coded cards is what we'll select. And you'll see a bunch of drop-down menus which control different aspects about your order, such as the quantity, full color printing on both sides or one side only, the coding, and the turnaround. You'll notice that when you change these options, such as uh, making the quantity 500, the price at the bottom updates accordingly. So we'll keep the quantity at 500. We'll make it a rush by changing the turnaround to four business days. And we'll also add on a PDF email proof. Once we're happy with that, we'll click Add to Cart. You'll be brought to this page here where you're able to add files to the item that you just ordered. Uh, so in this case, the business card. We'll click Add File. And I've got my artwork already zipped up in these folders. So we'll select the business card and click Start Upload. Once the file is uploaded, you'll be brought to the shopping cart screen. From here you have a few more options. You can add a name to the project, which is useful if you have multiple business cards and you want to differentiate which name goes with which file. You can also add comments to the order. And another handy option is add additional file. This way you can add multiple files to one item in your cart. This is useful if you have, say, artwork that is a front and back PDF in separate files. Uh, since we've got the business card added, we next need to add the postcard. You can head back up to the products drop down and select postcards from the list. Again, we'll do the 16 point coded cards. For the postcards, we're going to select a thousand cards and we're going to actually change the coding from matte aqueous to high gloss UV front matte aqueous back. This means we'll have a nice gloss coating on the front and still be able to write on the back of the card since it's a postcard. We'll click Add to Cart to complete that. And again, we'll add the file for the postcard by clicking Start Upload. So now back in the shopping cart, you can see we've got both the business card and postcard in our shopping cart. Uh, you'll also notice an enter coupon button here. To find out about discount coupons that we currently have, you can like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, or sign up for our newsletter. We're ready to check out now. After checking out, you're brought to this page where you can double check all the options you've selected about your order, and you can enter in your billing and shipping information. Since we're going to be picking up this order, we'll click the Collect at This Address button, which automatically fills in the club card's address in these boxes. 
If you have a shipping address, you can enter it in here, or you can click copy information from billing address if it's the same. We'll click continue. You'll be brought to this page where you can choose your shipping method. For this order, we'll leave it at pickup for zero dollars and the payment method, which is credit card. We'll click confirm order. And this is the last step before submitting your order to print. Simply enter in your credit card information and click confirm payment. Hope this video was useful. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to contact us. And be sure to check out clubcard.tv for more helpful tutorials. Thanks!